Hey guys, it's Cabo Vigari back. How are you guys doing today? Uh, we're on the way to pick up a truck. So I bought a, another little truck uh, that I think I'm gonna put my dump body on. Uh, my little dump truck, you know, it's a gas one and it won't run more than probably 45, 50, maybe 55. And I just want something that's a little bit more modern. So one of my friends had this truck for sale and I got, I think I got a hell of a deal on it. So uh, I think I'm gonna put my dump buddy over on that. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'm on my way to pay him now and we'll check out the truck when I get there. And then uh, it'll be a week or two before I come back out to pick it up. So, but yeah, I'll show you the truck. Well guys, here's the truck. It's a 1980 L7000. It has a 3208 cat in it. And uh, it was uh, originally a city truck for water. Uh, it says it has 49,000 miles on it. I don't know if that's right or not. But uh, it starts right up. It goes into all the gears. And it was cheap so pretty excited about this uh, the beds coming off of it I think I'm gonna put my dump bed on it and uh, finish up my dump truck and then my dump trucks gonna change to something else but yeah let's get in it and start it up As you can see, it's just dirty being an old truck. I'm at 49,000 miles. It's automatic with an Allison. I need to crawl under and see which one. It does have a broken dash piece there, and this thing's missing, I need to find. But, uh, starts right up. Really responsive. Like, super responsive. So, not too bad in here. Really, just a lot of cleaning. And, uh, it won't be too bad. Be good for a dump truck, for sure. Let's go, go under the hood. Tires are running underneath the hood. Three manufactured motor. I could comment on these because I had a uh, compression ring issue from when I was reading. But the uh, city maintained, so the boats are good. I mean, everything looks pretty good and pretty up to date. I'll probably go through the whole thing. Wiring's a little bit of a mess, but it's kind of how it was. But I'll clean it up. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. If anybody knows, it's spinning in there. I don't know what that does. If someone knows, I'd be curious. Suspension all looks good shape. The spring still got a good curl here. The shocks aren't missing off the front. Here's the other side. Yeah, both sides the shocks are missing. Uh, I guess this is the oil cooler. I'm not sure. I'll have to look into that. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I think it's going to work out really good for to put my dump bed on it and just be done with my dump truck with, a, with diesel powered, has enough power and everything like that. So tell me guys what you guys think in the comments below.